there, we're Laura and Tiff from Little Button Diaries and we've got two very simple clay crafts for you today. We've made these lovely little trinket dishes. The first one is an air dry clay leaf design and the second one is a lovely marbled, I'll just remove the little trinkets inside, lovely little marbled dish that we've made from FIMO polymer clay. Keep watching and we'll show you how to make them. Take your kilogram block of clay and cut it in half and then place it onto a sheet of cling film and roll it out to about a thickness of five millimetres. Place your template onto the clay and then use a modelling tool to draw around your template. Remove the template and then use a sharp knife to cut it out. Next, use the cling film to lift up the clay and place it into your bowl. Press around the clay with your fingers to push it into place and then leave it to dry overnight. Use the cling film again to lift it out of the bowl, remove the cling film and put it in a warm dry place to let it dry out completely. Take some sandpaper and then very gently sand the bowl all over. Give it a coat of paint using green paint and then leave to dry. Give it a coat of Mod Podge to give it a nice shine. To make your FIMO trinket dish, begin by cutting your FIMO into the quantities you would like. You need about 80 grams altogether. Then roll the FIMO into long sausages and twist them together and then roll out into another long sausage. Twist them together again, roll out again, keep going until you get a nice bleed of the colours. Then roll the FIMO into a ball. Take your FIMO ball and place it onto a piece of clean film and roll out to a thickness of roughly three millimetres. Then take a small dish, place it on top of the FIMO and cut around it. Remove the dish and then place your FIMO into a Pyrex bowl. Cook your FIMO in the Pyrex dish for 30 minutes on 130 degrees C. Once it's cooked, remove it from the oven, allow it to cool down and then give it a little coat of Mod Podge for some gloss. So there we have it, very quick and very easy crafts for you. There are loads more clay makes over on the Hobbycraft blog, so make sure you check them out. Thanks for watching.